My first job out of Medill was in Charleston, South Carolina as a local television news reporter. I was in a larger market local television in Atlanta. Uh, I was in syndication. I was in international cable, I was in domestic cable, and then I was in broadcast news. The definition of what journalism is is much broader today. In a lot of ways, I think there's more opportunity for somebody coming out of school today than there was for me. Today, every company is a media company. And every organization, every university, every governmental agency, everybody has a story to tell. And we, what we found is that different organizations really do want to bring their stories directly to their audiences, directly to the people, as it were. And, but they want to use the best skills that journalists have. I am really, really a product of Medill and Northwestern. The thing that carried me all the way through and the thing that started with Medill was the writing. The fundamentals really brought me through everything I did, from the smallest market, the 113th market, to the CBS Evening News. It was always the same. There were so many stories that um, I was privileged to be a part of, to have a front row seat, to be able to see. I've covered presidents and um, traveled in the world. But it's small stories about individual people that stick with me the most. I think one thing that's always defined Medill is that it trains you to think and it trains you to work. It took me a long time to realize that I was learning something besides an inverted pyramid or besides five W's and an H. I was learning a way of thinking and doing and creating. I've naturally gravitated to other journalists who went to Medill and we do have our own little fraternity. We do have our understanding of each other because we've all had the same experience. In a lot of cases, we've had the same professors. Uh, we know the same people. I picked my producer at CBS News because she was a Medillion. Nobody gets out of Medill that doesn't have the training, the experience to succeed in journalism.